I'm going to give you some information that's recent. This just came out 90 days ago. I suspected that this was going to be true. And if you don't get anything from me, please get this. By the time you wake up in the morning and by the time you go to bed at night, every thought, every feeling, every sensation that's hot, that's cold, is recorded by the subconscious mind. And it is replayed every night two to three times. Also at night, in a deep sleep, your subconscious can pull things from the past, things you haven't given up on. But that's not what's important. That's just interesting. Here's what's important. The last 30 minutes, the last 30 minutes before you go to sleep tonight, guess how many times that is replayed? when you go into a REM, rapid eye movement, deep sleep, 15 to 17 times. This is a quantifiable fact. When you go to bed tonight, the last 30 minutes, you need to see what you want, not what you don't want. And because things are so bad in the economy, we're seeing what we don't want. And we're replaying that in our minds. And if you go to bed like that, whether it's a a relationship that you don't like, you're trying to get out of, I'm seeing what I don't want. This is why a battered wife will stay with the guy forever. And you go, are you out of your mind? She goes to bed seeing what she doesn't want. The subconscious has that kind of power. And let me show you the power of the subconscious. I got to take a short nap. I was up all night practicing. So I, I'll be right back. <sighs> I hope I don't have a nightmare. I hate when that happens. <laughs> my heart's pounding. I'm sweating profusely. My mouth's dry. My hair's on end. You, well, wait a minute. You mean what I thought in the middle of the night? My subconscious mind, which controls my body language, my intuition, all my bodily function, it didn't know the difference between fantasy and reality. So it activated my body to react to something that wasn't even there. This is why the most powerful tool that you possess is visualization. Every night, visualize your next day. Your mantra should be, I've never had a day I haven't already had. Before every sales call, go to B. What do I want these people, what do I want this person to think when I walk out of their office? Whatever you want them to think becomes your agenda for that meeting. Work in reverse. Make up your mind. I'm an influencer of thought, but it depends on what you think. I want you to think less, positive, and not more.